What's up guys? This is Brent with 247parts.com and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to change out your normal three-point draft arms to telescoping draft arms. Let's get started. Now before we get started here, if you happen to like this video or this video helps you out, we just ask that you would hit that like button and subscribe to the channel as that helps me out as well. And then also if you're looking for more types of videos just over equipment in general, make sure to check out our other channel, Western Equipment. Okay, so pretty simple installation here, but first thing we need to do of course is remove our old arms. Now first thing we want to do is remove our turnbuckle system here. So we'll need a 24 millimeter socket and go ahead and break out that breakover bar. Ahead and ratchet that the rest of the way off here. That and our washer loose. And then we'll pull out our chain stud there. And we're gonna go ahead and break out our pliers here. Just like that. And then our bottom pin right down here is just a simple hand release just like that then we can simply pull off our old link we can slide that new one on go back on with our bottom pin back in here with our top pin our washer and keeper back on with our washer and back on with our nut all right and then we can move to the other side And just as easy as that, you've gone from the standard three-point arms now to the telescoping three-point arms. They're going to give you a little bit more range of motion here, which is gonna make that easier when hooking up to rear attachments. So a really good investment to look for and look at for your small tractors. Now this for the three series is gonna be part number BLV10919. And I'll make sure to leave a link to that down in the description below. And also guys, if you've seen any other tools and such in this video that you think that you may need, I'll also leave a link down in the description below where you can go to check those out. And just remember anytime that you guys go and check those out and buy from those links down there, that really helps me out. So I really appreciate it when you guys do that. Also, if you guys have any other questions or comments, make sure to leave those down in the comments section below so I can be sure to get back with you. And if you have any other parts needs for your John Deere equipment, whether it be for your tractors, your gators, your lawn mowers, or your compact construction equipment, make sure to dive around in those links whenever you go check that out. Look at all those parts there also. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Hey guys, make sure to go buy your parts right here and subscribe right here.